Hey Facebook friends, Kaylin McBee here with Healthy Living with Kaylin McBee. Today's three minute Thursday topic is omega-3s. So omega-3s are a kind of fat, uh, a good kind of fat that's found in the human body and also in some of the foods that we eat. Oftentimes we will hear about omega-3s being in uh, abundance in foods like seafood and fish specifically fish, um, mackerel, and tuna, and sardines, and salmon, which some people are just not into, so I understand. Or if you are looking for vegetarian sources, you can find omega-3s in nuts, specifically in walnuts, along with flaxseed and leafy vegetables. So there's been a lot of research done on omega-3s and their effects on our body. And I've done a little bit of research so that you don't have to. So here is some more information for you. Having a diet high in omega-3s can help reduce your blood pressure. One of the statistics that I saw on multiple um, studies was that if you're taking high level of omega-3s, it will actually help to reduce your triglyceride levels. So if you are trying to address those health markers, that could be very helpful. Another really interesting statistic that I saw was that omega-3s can also help to decrease the symptoms for rheumatoid arthritis, which I found to be really interesting. I was just talking with a friend who has a diagnosis of RA, which I didn't know about. She's currently on other medications, but one of the suggestions that I'm definitely gonna give to her is to make sure that she's paying attention to her level of omega-3 intake. Um, there are some studies, although they're not 100% conclusive, that there are also effects on some mental aspects of your health by taking omega-3s. One of them is depression, another is ADHD, and then finally Alzheimer's. So there has been study, there have been studies done, although not super conclusive. And then finally, pregnant mothers who are ingesting uh, normal levels of omega-3s tend to have healthier babies with less asthma, which I found to be really interesting. So if mackerel and salmon and sardines don't seem appealing to you, there are really good quality, healthy omega-3s that are available on the market, and I'd be happy to share what some options might be. So hopefully this was helpful for you. So today's topic again was omega-3s. If you have any questions or if you'd like to see specific topics discussed on 3 Minute Thursdays, please feel free to leave a comment below. Otherwise, this is Kaylin McBee. Be healthy.